I'd like to take you on a short tour of the new Package Checker plugin, which is bundled with JetBrains IntelliJ Idea Ultimate. We'll start by looking at this project, Java Vulnerable Lab, which uses Maven as a package manager. As such, it uses POMXML as the manifest file, explicitly mentioning all the dependencies needed for this project. Opening the POMXML file, we can see the Dependency Checker plugin highlights vulnerable dependencies. By hovering over, it shows all the vulnerabilities that Checkmark's identified in this package. By clicking on the vulnerability, I'm redirected to the Checkmark's advisory to learn more about this vulnerability. Going back to the project, I can also see all the vulnerable packages by right-clicking on the POM XML and under Analyze, click on Show Vulnerable Dependencies. This will open the Vulnerable Checker window. These are divided into all the vulnerable packages for the POM XML file. This name is also mentioned here. We can see the dependency tree and the hierarchy between the packages. Here, for example, are the three direct packages that are vulnerable in the POM XML. These two are the transitive packages that are also vulnerable. And here you can see all the vulnerable packages in a flat view from all the POM XMLs that are in this project. Again, clicking on the specific package and going to a specific vulnerability, I can learn more about this vulnerability in the Checkmarks Advisory. We can click on this button here to see all the dependencies regardless if they're vulnerable or not. And again, in two different views, with the dependency hierarchy view or just the flat view. Another feature of the dependency checker plugin allows us to easily remediate those vulnerability dependencies. I can either copy the safe version and just paste it here, or I can go to a specific vulnerability dependency and under the hover menu, I can click on this action or just use the intention action shortcut, Alt Enter. By changing the version, I'll have a new option here, Load Maven Changes. By loading the Maven Changes, Dependency Checker will identify the change in the dependencies, and I can see that the org JSON is not vulnerable anymore. Clicking here, I can see it was updated.